Yes, students, welcome back into my another video. Today I will discuss uh, the important questions of applied chemistry for mechanical steel. This is the passing package. Okay, first of all, I will discuss the passing modules. And uh, remember, this is for also backlog students. Uh, if somebody is having backlog in uh, applied chemistry subject, they can also refer this one. Okay, but particularly this is for regular stream students, right? So let me discuss here first passing module that is module second, in which you have to cover five questions. Uh, define corrosion, explain different types of corrosion and explain the electrochemical theory of corrosion with an example and define electroplating and electrolysplating and uh, discuss electroplating of hard chromium coating and electrolysplating of nickel this may be the separate question define electroplating and discuss electroplating of hard chromium and sometimes define electrolysplating and explain the electrolysplating of nickel right next is what is galvanization mention its applications explain corrosion control by anodization these are the five questions which you have to cover from the module second most super important questions so next is module first it is again a passing module in which you have to cover some super important questions like explain the construction and working of photovoltaic cells and explain their applications explain the construction working of lithium ion battery and methanol oxygen fuel cell next is how to determine the calorific value using bomb calorimeter this is super important one and next is explain the synthesis of biodiesel by uh, tran transistorification and explain with applications write down the importance of green fuel next is what is the gross calorific value gcv and ncv that is net calorific value of chemical fuel and if you are convenient if the problems are simpler then go for the numericals also right next is module fifth which is also a passing module in which you have to cover expand composition properties and applications of stainless steel and uh, what are alloys explain composition on and properties and applications of stainless steel and alnico next is explain the synthesis of nanomaterials by sol gel method write down the properties and engineering applications of carbon nanotubes and graphene okay so next this is all about module fifth now let me take some other questions from module fifth that is what are the nanomaterials how the nanomaterial properties like optical catalytic are dependent on size of particle write a short note on ceramics write its classification based on chemical composition also write down applications for gross kites right next is module fourth in which uh, you should go through these uh, what we call construction part okay write down construction and working principle of potentiometric sensors as i mentioned in the previous video uh, this chemistry is the diagrammatic subject so you should focus on diagrams much more than the theoretical part so potentiometric sensors and its application in estimation of iron and optical sensors it is application in estimation of copper and ph sensor of ph sensor and its determination in of ph of beverages right so next is define phase rule explain the terms like phase components degree of freedom with examples and discuss lead silver two component system along with the phase diagram explain the estimation of fas using potentiometric sensors this is all about model four now let me conclude with the model third explain the synthesis and applications of kevlar fibers pmma and teflon what are the lubricants what are its properties and hence write down its applications explain the properties and applications of carbon based polymer composites in industrial application and explain metal matrix composite with an example explain any four properties and applications of mmc's metal matrix composites write down synthesis properties and industrial applications of uh, polyvinyl chloride pvc and poly polystyrene so this is all about model third so go through these important questions to conquer applied chemistry with the flying colors so i wish you all the best for your examinations thanks for watching my video and make sure you will share this video to all your friends